Good, I'm, I'm good. I'm good. Good, good you ain't been sick, had you? No, I haven't heard at all. How are you, brother? Yeah. How you doing? You need a coat. Jim. Yeah. Too cold to stand up. <laughs> yeah, it is cold. We're getting in closer. Huh? We're getting in closer. Having a televised discussion. Come on in, have a seat. Get out the cold. Ah, uh, I've heard you preach two or three times. I sure would like for you to come on television with me, though. We're getting in closer. Huh? We're getting in closer. Having a televised discussion. Come on in, have a seat. Get out the cold. Ah, uh, I've heard you preach two or three times. I sure would like for you to come on television with me, though. We're getting in closer. Huh? We're getting in closer, having no, no. a televised discussion. Come on in, have a seat, get out the cold. Ah, uh, I've heard you preach two or three times. I sure would like for you to come on television with me, though. Oh, well. Hey. Come on in, rush us up. Don't stand uh, there. I've already heard you preach two or three times. Okay. I, I know, I know, I'm not gonna get anywhere as far as the last time. The last come time come I did, on, have I, a seat, and get out. The last time I came in, that's everybody it. said, "This is what happened. That's what happened." Nobody gonna bother. You. No, no, they didn't do that. No, I'm no. saying it was a very. I, I enjoyed myself. Good. It was very friendly, but I'm saying people afterwards said. Johnny, you did this. You know this don't answer. worry about what people say. I'm just Come saying, on I'm, I'm giving you an invite again. I'm giving you an invite again for telling you. All right. Brother, well, have a good seat. You know, friends, all I'm doing is saying that here's a man who says he's, he's uh, bold and he'll challenge anybody and talk to anybody anywhere, and we've given him his, his chance, and uh, he hasn't taken it. And, and not only that, I want to continue my thought, which, uh, which I was saying before the two ladies a moment ago called in. This is Johnny Robertson. You're on What's the Bible Say? Yes, sir. I was there today, and Pastor Jennings did not accept your challenge the way that you proposed it to him today. But he did tell you to give him your name, the church you belong to, and everything, and that you could email him or he email you and set up another time that both that was convenient for the both of you all to be on Cable 6. So he did not deny you your challenge. He just told you that at this specific time, because he came down and the hours that he had set for his services, he was not going to interrupt his itinerary just for you at this time. If you had have... Why, why, uh, what I'm saying, ma'am, why? You that if you had reached him before he got to Martinsville, then he would, you know, you all could have set up something that was convenient for the two of you. You called that man an antichrist. You cannot make that statement. What he said to you was that he do not prepare a sermon. He don't sit up on Saturdays and write down the text and the scripture that he's going to preach from. He said that he's filled with the Holy Ghost, and when the Holy Ghost comes over him, that the Lord gives him what he needs to say. Okay. Well, if he's so ready and the Lord gives him what he needs to say, how come he's not up here right now? Because... Listen to you, sir. Listen. I'm listening. Your man is the I'm one who said, ma'am. He said during his right speech. There. Look, you, I'm not going to argue with you because okay. see, I just explained what happened. And that's why, twisted. that's why though, he needs to be here now. Hey. Because now, I if he was here, be here now. because if he was here, the community wouldn't have to be listening but to you. Come here to go, come on cable. Would you, would you let me talk? Best Western from 3 to 5 today. Ma'am. And from 3 to 7 tomorrow. He didn't come here to challenge you. I'm going to go ahead and talk. Uh, because she won't let me say, say a word. During his lesson, he said he was ready and that he would answer anybody anytime. Yeah. You ran out the building. Ma'am, would you let me talk a minute? Are you going to let me talk? Are we going to have a discussion? Are you just going to take over? I'm going to listen. All right. I, he said that he was ready for me, and I said this. I said, sir, why should we discuss, if he's ready, what difference does it make where it is? And I said, these people can all go home and turn on their television. They can hear it, and the community can hear it. Now, evidently, he doesn't want to come on, okay. uh, on public.